we would like our neighbors to be able to share in this as well. Mm -hmm. And this is why, as a private entrepreneur, I've been supported or pushed by the government to try to make as many investments as possible along the One Belt, One Road path, which means, hopefully, bring prosperity to our neighbors, yeah. which means better India's peace. Do you think India's concerns are, are unfounded? Uh, I don't think India's concerns are unfounded. I mean, if you look at the investments that have been made, uh, uh, prob probably if you want to look at CPEC or if you want to look, look at the investment made in the Sri Lankan port, all these projects have very high uh, possibilities of putting the country into debt. Uh, and because of which, uh, take example of the Sri Lankan port, the, it was leased to the Chinese government for next 100 years. Yeah. Now, this means that the Chinese get to operate the uh, port for the next hundred years and that becomes a military concern for India. Well, so you're talking about geopolitics in this context. Allow me to, no. right? Yeah. Hear what you say about India's aspirations or <coughs> India, India's concerns about security and so on and so forth. It's interesting because in terms of the, the, the project with Pakistan, including the solar project in the which CPEC, I, particip yeah. I participated in investing in, and the railway, to me, it's just simple business, yeah. mm -hmm. straight simple business, mm -hmm. because it means, oh, natural gas yeah. can come from Iran without going through the Malacca Strait, which may be blocked by the Seventh Fleet. That's it, the concern, actually. That's like you're a businessman. What India's concern is that would not, would ch they don't want, they don't have any fear against somebody else coming in making Pakistan prosperous. Mm -hmm. A prosperous Pakistan is good for India. The concern that India has, if Pakistan is not able to pay back those loans, what happens then? Uh, because these are often most of these projects are guaranteed at a rate of interest or mm -hmm. some investment. Well, this, so far our, yeah. our investment has been very profitable. Yes. <laughs> so, so but if if it's you know whether or not Pakistan pays back or pays back in full yeah. or it's delayed payment or some, yeah. something, that's between Pakistan and Chinese banks. Exactly. And so not, I don't know what... Ma Ma Manish, my question for you, Manish, just is... Just to uh, jump on that, just to jump on that, because that was, uh, it's related to what I earlier yeah. was saying, because yeah. uh, that's what happened in Sri Lanka, you know, the, the Sri Lankans were unable to pay back for the ports, mm -hmm. the investment Chinese made in their ports, and that's why the Chinese got a lease to, uh, for next 100 years. Now, that becomes a concern for India if if China invests in every of its neighbors and then these neighbors get debt ridden and then have to give their infrastructure and important strategic infrastructure to China on lease for hundreds of years. Yeah. So that's, that's the important concern. And India, as you rightly <coughs> said, does not want to block any country from prospering. And that's yeah. why we are part of the Shanghai Cooperation and also yeah. the uh, Asian Infrastructure Investment Bank and the NDB.